what is up guys? Earn the Worm here with another QFig review. And this one was exclusive to the June 2017 Loot Crate. And Loot Crate is really getting me hooked on these QFigs. This one is a black and white Daily Bugle Spider-Man. And it just, it looks like he's printed on the pages of a newspaper. Very cool. A lot of them don't actually have Loot Crate Limited Edition on it or anything, but this one does say Loot Crate Limited Edition. But here is the side of the box. Here is the back of the box. And the other side all with pictures of the actual Q-Fig. And the front again, so I will take a second, get him out of this box so we can have a closer look at him. Alright, here is our Loot Crate exclusive Spider-Man Q-Fig out of packaging. And like I said before, this really looks like it was just pulled off of the pages of the Daily Bugle. There is a regular version of this Spider-Man where he's hanging on the light post but has a camera in his hand. And it is the normal collars of Spider-Man. There's just something I really like about this one looking like it came off of the newspaper. Very cool pose too, and he does dangle. That web does have some give to it. So I'm really starting to like these Q-Figs. I love Funko Mystery Minis, but these Q-Figs set up such a nice little scene with this light post. You have a little bit of sidewalk from the street. Just really cool. I do wish they were a little smaller because these bases, I could probably put five mystery minis where I can put one Q-Fig. But on the other hand, I could use this base and set some mystery minis actually on this one. Some of them, I don't really think there's enough room to put mystery minis on it. This one though, I probably could get three or four mystery minis on there. So a nice bonus on this one. So that is my look at this Loot Crate exclusive Daily Bugle Spider-Man Q-Fig. Very cool Q-Fig if you missed out on it in the Loot Crate. I'm sure plenty of them have it eBay. Not sure what they're going to charge for them on there. But the whole Loot Crate box itself is only $22, so I wouldn't pay any more than that for it. It is very cool, and if you do get Loot Crate, then you got yourself a really cool figure this month, I feel. I love how he's shooting that web. Just all around a really cool piece. And with Homecoming coming out right around the corner, makes it that much cooler to get a Spider-Man figure this month. But that is all I have for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it, and I will see you guys next time. Have a good one, and bye for now.